So one was of course the training for Margarita with a straw. I spent a long time on that wheelchair uh, getting to understand what Malini's life was like. Film festivals, you know, it just makes you understand uh, a completely different culture in a much more universal way. Whenever I'm doing a film, the first question I'm asked by most fans is, hero con hai, you know? Understanding that a woman can also carry a film, or even if she's not carrying a film, like that she's integral to the plot of the film. I think especially in our industry, that hero-based model of writing is still very prominent. So I would really like that to change. I have to read the script and love it. And immediately after, if I'm Googling it, uh, you know, finding out about the subject, then that, that's a really good sign because it means something which already tickles the curiosity. And the second thing is, of course, that I don't repeat myself. Yeah, these are usually the criteria. Sometimes it's a paycheck. Sometimes it's the directors. The um, basic description of feminism is gender equality, equality between men and women. If we lived in a matriarchal society, maybe I would be a meninist, you know, maybe we would need to support the rights of the weaker sex. <laughs> Wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> The fact is that this stuff does exist and people just aren't aware enough about it. Why aren't men also being curious about this subject? Why is it always the women? So I think this is more than women's battle, it's about gender equality and that requires both sexes to be involved in the conversation. I don't think there's any sort of grand master plan. There's, there's this Japanese quote which says, uh, today better than yesterday, worse than tomorrow. So every day is just a little, little bit of a step.